when the two car things is working out really well, that works really well with your analytical people. Yeah. Okay. Um, we use that and um, to uh, make more money. Like um, some stores we have, they'll do like you know ten or hundred thousand mile powertrain warranty. They'll put on all their cars and they'll upsell to a service contract. I'll tell you what, I found that I'm kind of shocked. Every time we do that, their service contract production goes up and ends up paying for it, which is weird. Okay, you yeah, wouldn't have thought that. that. I figured yeah. they just go. I already have a warranty. I don't need mm -hmm. it. And it's just going to increase the cost of the car yeah. and decrease what you sell. Yeah. Well, what, what ends up happening is the salespeople sell a 10 100 so much. That, you know, uh, the idea is like, look, we have all this and we've already spent all the money on this and it covers the most expensive parts of your car. We're able to cover your whole thing up to 100,000 miles and everything's covered and here's payment. It's the best thing ever. Why wouldn't you do it? And we actually, you'll find out it goes higher. It's weird. Um, it's like some clothes, yeah. Well, it's like key care. We give a free year of key care at a they have nine stores. They run 60% key care. Anybody in this room run 60% key care? Nope. It's weird. It also makes them focus. So like, a, like as an owner, you put a 10 year 100, you're paying for it. You know, upsell that. So that costs, uh, like it makes money and it goes away. You know? So then you start looking at what does it really cost you and it's not that much. But it's perceived value. But that two car story is where I'm going with the 10 100 or the Advantage piece you use. I got two cars. They're looking at uh, one down the street. They're pretty much similar. It's a little different with use a little bit, but you still have the same scenario. I want to buy an Armada here or there. Yours is a thousand bucks more. Pretty much the same equipment and everything else. So let's say they're the same car. Well, the only way I can sell my car at this point is just to lower the cost. They're gonna go buy somewhere else, same car. I only, my only option right now is lower the cost, right? Or I could have valuable things to talk about. Okay, we're the same car now. Now we're 500 bucks apart, but let me ask you a question. You got this 10 100, it's got these benefits, got your key care, got this. Is our car worth more? Yes. Okay. Now, maybe it doesn't go with 500, but can we meet me somewhere in the middle here? Here and I can maybe, you know, at the same price that they're selling theirs for? Yeah. Because every now, every other dealership is dropping at 500 bucks to 1,000 to sell it. It's a way to hold gross.